What's good, y'all? Sean Two Smooth Game. We back out here with the farewell tour. As you can see, we passed Breeze last time and only about 500 yards away from passing Tom Brady. Quick look at the past success for the season and also let you know that the Broncos have finally clinched the playoff spot, but not the division. And let's get into the Saints game. Hope y'all are doing blessed, feeling good. Another post-game commentary for y'all. I hope y'all have been liking these, man. I'm trying to push this content out as quick as possible. I got a bunch of this lined up. I got some 2K lined up. And I do got more, you know, daily vlog type things uh, recorded. Just got to edit them. And then, you know, probably, oh, hopefully at the time that you're seeing this, they've been editing and scheduled to put up. Because, you know, I'm batch recording these. Um, and this probably won't go up for a while. But at the time of recording this, All-Star Weekend just happened. It was amazing. It was sick. It was tight. I'm using a whole bunch of words that ain't even style no more. But very competitive. Wait, did y'all see that? The screen flash. Where's the touchdown? At? Oh, no. I do not know how he caught that and made his way into the end zone. But good job, Freeman. You out here balling out today. Okay, okay. Catching traffic done gone up. He did turn into a possession receiver on me. I, I like it. I like it. But anyway, All-Star Weekend was great. I love the skills challenge, the three-point challenge. The dunk, dunk contest is a little questionable now. You know, he did jump over a almost eight-foot tall man to get the dunk. I think he should have won that, and there shouldn't even been like a, oh, I was trying to get it to tie. Uh, that ain't even tie worthy. He just jumped over an almost eight-foot tall dude for the dunk. Freeman's catching traffic must be a 99 now because that's two times that he did three times that he didn't did it but two times for a touchdown that he didn't bullied his way into the end zone but yeah I, I understand his frustration I'd be mad too uh that he probably should have at least this year I didn't I don't remember last year's at least so I don't know how much of a gripe he actually has for last year but as far as this year go he he should have won that but the all-star game i love the sequence you know seeing them go back and forth and winning quarter one and Giannis winning quarter two and then them tying quarter three and then just adding 24 you know for kobe shout out r.i.p uh for the fourth quarter and just watching them go at it now Joel and b say you can't win on the free throw but maybe if y'all play a little better defense he wouldn't even have the chance to so don't blame them for how the rules is. You know, you should have just played better defense. You pulled my dude to the... What the... Shoot, he should have played defense like y'all did. And then maybe he would have stopped that touchdown. But, yeah... I like the way it ended. I had fun watching it. I love the tributes to Kobe. I love changing the the name of the All-Star MVP trophy to Kobe Bryant's name. You know, now we just need to change that logo. You know, I, where that petition at? Let me sign it because we need that for him. He needs to be able to go ahead and leave his mark even more on the game than he already did when he was alive. Boy! The, boy! I don't know why he just did 15 jukes into the backfield, but it is what it is. And then, oh my gosh, bro, everybody must have catching traffic this game. I don't know what it is, but, oh wait, did y'all see that? Oh, did, are they disrespecting? I ain't even going to talk no more. Grace, go ahead and do you. tell me twice anyway y'all can see we're gonna get into the gameplay a little bit here third quarter we're up 28 to 3 hand the ball off oh my goodness 5 or 17 dang how you that means before that you was like four for two what that big run for no reason oh wide open gonna throw it i could have ran there but like i said we're trying to get these passing yards so we can go ahead and set things up for you know the ultimate takeover of tom brady okay 
good job there we're trying to make it as little yards as possible i mean i can have a 500 600 yard game here i've done it before but i don't think we're gonna have enough time to i'm only at about yeah 337 here in the third quarter not enough time to especially because we're probably running a lot in the fourth quarter just go ahead and get up out of here not try to run up the score oh my oh can't touch this then and then oh hold up what's it for yes sir uh, rough in the passer or no unnecessary roughness give me them extra yards yes sir be angry you should have signed me and then that wouldn't have happened all right roll out right again let's take off oh dang i couldn't get in so we're going to settle for three there uh you see 31 to 6 here five minutes left Ooh, this is a weird formation i don't even remember doing this clock management i almost saw some passing in there i like that i did a fake spike <laughs> that shows you i don't care about this team but fake spike run to the outside Ooh, oh whew, thank goodness that got out of bounds dang we didn't get it all the way there all right oh wait i remember what happened we're gonna slow it down and out of nowhere randomly um yeah touchdown <laughs> Nothing came up on the play art. Nothing. I was speeding through it, so I didn't even notice. And then we get a turnover as well. So we're now at the 26 uh, as I get sacked because our offensive line is booty cheeks. But another play fake here. We're up 38. Oh, my. My bad. Get him. Damn, you see me? I'm over there trying to run and play safety. Oh, my gosh. Doing this search for no reason. They still only get three, so... Under two minutes left, let's just run the ball out, see if they use their timeouts. Looks like they're not going to, so let me throw the ball a couple more times. Why not? And we're just going to need things out here to go ahead and wrap this game up, get to the post-game stats. You see 351, four touchdowns and an interception for me, and 20 yards for McAllister, 48 rushing for me, and Ross had 12. Did he get hurt this game? No, he did not. Okay, good job, Ross. Freeman over 153 touchdowns. He had a great game. Graves, I told y'all he's going to get back right. 100 yards and a touchdown. 72 for Stanley. And with that, I think that'll set up to where we only need about 218 more yards to pass Tom Brady. Uh, we got the Jets next game. And we're gonna, I'm going to let y'all look for yourselves. Any other teams that have clinched anything going into the final week of the season. We're going to have to play the Jets who are right now fighting with the Broncos for the top seed. But hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'll catch y'all next time. Peace.